This week on Santa Clara Source, the City Council held a study session to review the proposed fiscal year 2019-2020 and 2020-2021 biennial operating budget and capital improvement program budget adjustments. Another study session on the proposed budget will be held on June 4th with the final Council consideration of the budget on June 25th. The Council also reviewed and provided input on City Council policy priorities as a follow-up to January's priority setting session that was held over two days. The Santa Clara Library Foundation and Friends presented their accomplishments for the fiscal year 2018-2019. The Santa Clara Sister Cities Association made a presentation on their exchange visit to Limerick, Ireland. And the City Council proclaimed this week Affordable Housing Week. Meanwhile, the Council approved an affordable housing agreement with St. Anton for a 196-unit affordable apartment community within the Tasman East Specific Plan area. The 100% affordable housing project will remain affordable for 55 years. A temporary moratorium on all commercial cannabis activity was extended by the Council through June 30, 2020. Council approved the fiscal year 2019-2020 annual action plan for the use of federal housing and urban development funds and directed staff to incorporate all public comments into the final version for submission to the U.S. Department of Housing and Urban Development. Also, the Council unanimously adopted a resolution amending Silicon Valley Power's rules and regulations to align with the City's sustainability commitment and advance the City's local climate action plan goals. Finally, in relation to the voter-approved Measure N, the Council approved an appointment process to select a new Charter Review Committee, and also approved that this Charter Amendment language will be placed on the November 2020 ballot. And that's your Santa Clara source for this week. For the latest city happenings, visit us online at santaclaraca.gov.